Hello everyone, it's me Jojo. Welcome to my channel and today we're going to be um, running blur on Winlator. You see, I have a confession to make, okay? I've had a very, very, very long... I've had the game for a very long time, actually. Like, for a serious amount of time. I've had this for a long time. But I never really got the chance to... I, I never got the chance to, um, you know, just showcase it. So, that's what I'm going to do today. And I'm going to show you the settings I used and what I used for the frame rate. You know, just, 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 um, just for that, okay? So, this game, let me tell you this beforehand. You can actually, it's only you, um, 20 to 30 FPS or 40 FPS if you are lucky. On, it depends on the performance. I'm using a Snapdragon 8 Gen 1, but if I have a better processor, maybe I might be able to get good frames. But it seems that no matter what setting you put, this game just puts itself at um, six, um, 30 or 20. Okay, so we're getting decent frame rates, but for some reason it's chopping. Okay, so I think it's the car itself I'm using. I think it's because of I'm recording. That's why the whole frame rate is like this. Okay. So, well, we are seeing the gameplay. I've um, the frame rate is down because of I'm screen recording, but usually it would be around, let's say, twenty to thirty. Now I am using Winlator um um Gil BC but um I I'm going to be telling you the way you should run it on regular Winlator like it doesn't matter the settings apply to everyone So well uh, this is all because of uh, you know I'm recording and uh, now my GPU is trying to um handle recording and um, emulation at the same time so we're going to have to quit now now as we've quit we are go to settings and we um get well we just get sent straight to the settings naturally so what is here that you have to put so for maximum FPS, I realized this is a standard and if you've reached this level, congratulations, you are hearing this. This is the standard for for emulating. Well, most of you, I guess you are on, you are on your phones, so well, we are not rendering this on a big screen, so you won't notice it. I mean, I'm do using this on my tablet, my S uh, S8 tablet, so some of the pixelated stuff of the uh, in the rendering resolution, it's affecting the visuals, but for frames okay for playable frames 480p is the is the only one that you should select or probably 9 um, 544 but i recommend 480 for max frame rate your tonic version it doesn't really matter but it's your dxvk version here on your regular win later you should have 1.10.3 you should have it um 2.4 is up um, is okay but um 10.3 is the middle ground and it works really well um, I'm just going to put max device memory. Maybe the game is lagging because there's no allocated memory. I'm just saying. You put that pulse audio. I just left it as also just to see how it works and it wasn't fun. So, um, pulse audio is the go-to. This is um, win later um, 7.1.3, I think, version 2. So, that's why it has all this weird stuff here. But for a regular win later, just run it the way you... Just um, run it like that. Um, you use these settings, though I don't recommend this one since it's not on current or regular win later. But for the mods, it should be here. Put FIFO or mailbox, I think. But mailbox should be the best. A um, Mesa shader cage disable. For some reason, it helps with the loading. Though some things won't be won't be rendered, so like it you won't be having any cached stuff. Um, put your boxes before preset at performance. Don't put any new anything. Just leave that performance. It's okay. Um, exec argument. I believe it might work. It might not work. But forcing directory D11 is the best for it. And you do and uh, you press okay and you well you run it. 
Um, okay, yes, why is it 7.1.3? We go to our settings, our box 64 version. We put that the latest because, well, the latest version it has more, you know, more um, things to it, it has more um, compatibility to it. Um, we come back here, we go to our shortcuts. You see, even this beach buggy racing, too. I mean, I have other games, I just created a new container. The problem with my emulating and emulating is that when you put in the settings and you crash your game, it's not really fun. And as a kid, you know, having to uninstall and reinstall a game in an app, it's not fun. So, well, we're going to run it. Let's play it. I hope it works. And it crashed. Okay, let's see why it crashed. Is it mailbox or FIFO? I think we'll put that immediate just for fun. Or is it the oh, I see what's happening here. We stop this. We don't need to force no nothing. I believe, yes, we don't need to force anything. Please work, please work, please work. You know, we emulating on Willy is just trial and error, trial and error. And we've been screwed apparently, right. But I think it's the box 64 version 0.3.1. I think that's the stable one. We try to run it again. We pray it works. And it worked. Yay. I hope we get a decent frame rate. Okay. Okay, everything is looking stable. I hope, I pray it works. I pray it works decently than last time. Though I must say the GPU is recording and it's trying to emulate. So, well, you understand. Okay, the frame rate, if it's 30 to 20, I will be okay. Okay, and it is. And we're getting 30 to 20. Yes, we've done it. Now, these are the settings you have to put in order to run your oh that was close in order to run your games at well max potential these are the settings you have to put and i must say well follow them sometimes you will your frames will drop but don't worry in the long run i believe i hope okay and i'm just okay i think it was because of that um, um power of that was what was making the game to um lag like that Ah, uh, my fan run failed. So, well, this is everything about it. Um, let's see. We've done a full lap now. No issues. Well, the frame rate isn't stable, but I mean, it's not because um, we're in first place. You know, it's not rendering any blocky stuff. You know, someone should fight me, but I think racing games don't really need all that graphical enhancements. They don't need it. Okay. And if we, if I maintain my driving. Yes. I just I want to play a full lap just so that in case there's any issue, you know. Oh, I I was waiting for this. I've been I've been screwed. The frame rate is still stable. It's still stable.
you know if the frame rate is this stable maybe on my channel i might actually do a playthrough of this thing like a full playthrough just okay wait did i just i just i just reached the person that was at last place that is sick so well it loads fine even for when while we're screen recording so when was when, when i'm not screen recording the frame rates should be amazing i believe i mean this should be nice so well this is it for the video um i didn't want to be imposing this on you so please like and subscribe um you know i'll just have to glance this over because of uh i forgot to show you guys so these are my container settings but my container settings don't really matter because of well um your shortcut is what matters what you do on your shortcut on your container all you need all, all, the only thing that really are directly affects are your um, affects the game is your um, environment variables and this your startup selection and all this processor affinity that's all but anything else is n n n, that's not that's that doesn't matter so well i'm done with the video um i'm going to say this again and again but please like and subscribe Just comment if you have any questions suggestions on how to fight instead of fleeing west <laughs> okay sorry for the reference sorry so well bye keep gaming and have a good day